Good morning, Mrs. Olson, teachers and students. Please stand respectfully, let us pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Heavenly Father, in your infinite love and mercy, we heed the prayer of your beloved servant, Rita. We graciously grant favors through your intercession, which are considered impossible to human skill and effort. Relying on your compassionate love, we ask you to assist us in our trials and difficulties. Let unbelievers know that you are the helper of the humble, the defender of the weak, and the strength of those who trust in you. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For our schools, friends, and benefactors, especially for Mrs. Caston, we offer our daily prayers. St. Wilfred, pray for us. St. Rita, pray, pray for us. us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. I pledge allegiance to the cross of Christ and to the church for which he stands, one holy, Catholic, and apostolic, with grace and salvation for all. Salute to the flag. I pledge allegiance to, to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, boys and girls. I hope that you're having a good start to your Tuesday and that you enjoyed your day off yesterday. Uh, I want to ask you to join me in um, a special prayer for those in our community who are sick for my teacher friend, Terry, who is fighting cancer, and for all of those in our community who um, have some sort of health issue that they are either concerned about or they are uh, hoping to recover from. So let's all say a Hail Mary for all of them. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. So uh, things happening this week. Um, remember that every day at 6.15 p.m., you are invited to join in um, the rosary uh, at the church. So 6.15 daily. And on the 25th, I believe, the school is asked to lead in that prayer. So you'll have that opportunity to join your school friends and teachers um, on that day as well. Remember that this week there is football practice, and if you have not already paid your sports fees, um, you should be taking care of those right away. On uh, tomorrow, Wednesday, we have a half day as we do every Wednesday. You should wear your formal uniform, and we'll be going directly up to Mass. That is our new procedure. We'll be going from right at uh, the school bell, we'll be heading up to Mass. Those seventh graders that will be lecturing and altar serving will leave up to the church immediately upon arrival so they can be prepared. And then we'll have our morning assembly following Mass. Um, uh, our seventh and eighth graders will have Life 101. And then our, in the afternoon, our teachers will have catechetical training for the CSU. Um, this Saturday, there's football at modern day catholic high school varsity versus saint rose at 7 30 and jv versus saint rose at nine and i want to say congratulations to our varsity football team i heard they played a tough game um, and uh, they didn't win but they it was a hard fought game so congratulations to all of you for your efforts and, and for representing saint Reed as well we had a great meeting last week uh, with our PTG, and we have wonderful plants for Halloween Carnival. So I can't wait for you to see all of those. And we also have Red Ribbon Week coming up. Lots happening. Okay, we have no birthdays to celebrate today. So boys and girls, I'd like to just um, hope that you have a great day. And I look forward to seeing you out on the playground. Have a good day.